Hi guys, it's your favorite baby. It's Peppy Sam. So while you're watching this video, it's already 2020. So happy new year. Happy new year. Happy new year. Come on, right? Happy new year everyone. My dear Peppy. Happy new year. So I haven't a vlog for a while. It's been almost two weeks. <laughs> since the last look but and I haven't vlogged with any content for the new year since I used that time to be with my close group here in here in Thailand it's just literally Bengal so anyways while I'm doing this uh, video I'm doing my nighttime routine so I'm, you will know what I'm doing so yeah, so this video, I wanted to film this because I want to look back also with my 2019. So 2019 was really tough for me. Some knew about it, and most and most of my acquaintances, family, or other friends don't know it, but I. I may say that um, it really crushed me so hard that it's so hard to wake up every day of 2018 feeling tired, feeling so emotionally stressed, emotionally bothered, and emotionally unstable. A lot of challenges really came last 2019 and it broke my back not literally but so hard it is but moving forward to this day i'm thankful since i somewhat uh, know myself more i've become i've become more attached to my inner self i've Recently, heard my inner self crying that like, yeah, his cowboy. It's in Hiligaynon. You know? That means tired cowboy. He used to tell it to someone that I'm tired, but that person was not listening to me. That person thought that like I'm just a drama queen. Or something. Anyways, I, I applied my toner from Nature's Inspired Botanics. Ooh, Botanics. Yeah. No fragrance, so it's so, so nice. Alright, so I'm gonna apply. Clear nose. Straight all over my face. So, yeah, that person whom I thought I could find some. Confinant, confidante. How do you pronounce that word? Yeah, I, I thought I'll get it from that person. But it's so sad to know that my expectation wasn't meant. Like, it was like... So frustrating. Like with all of the people that I've been expecting to to be there, when I'm feeling so low, wasn't there. But on the brighter side, I'm still thankful because I have lots of really good relations. And I mean, when I say good, I mean it's quality. So I'm really thankful I have those people with me. Which I'm really happy. I am really, really, really grateful for them. So guys, 2019 is really about achieving 
a healthy mentality for me, I think. I was, I was studying the year that I said that I'll focus about my career, about about my plans, my career, how to grow my my career, or how to grow here in Thai, where to go, what to do. But you know what? I compromised my mental health. And it wasn't easy. Hello? Who does have like mental health issue that seems to be easy? That nga okay lang or like kapos lang. It's not. And I experience it. But you know what? Given given the the choice if I want to go back there, I think yeah, go. Because I want to learn a lot last year if I haven't been in those situation. So, moving forward to 2020, guys. This time, I'll be working on my transformation. And this video will be my witness. Will be, will be my reminder that I'm working on a positive transformation of myself. And I also want this video to inspire others out there, especially my babies. Like, uh, having problems or insecurities about themselves. Like me, like I'm so insecure, guys. You might not know, but I have sets of insecurities. Like how my friends would say, like, wala ka man insecurity. Or something. I have. I just chose not, not to really bother about it. But like recently lang, I boom siya. I boom siya. So like, nagigyan ako. Insecure sa self. Like I've been uh, looking at my Facebook home. I've been seeing this people achieving this, achieving that, going here, doing this, doing some highlights in their life. I was jealous because I think I haven't achieved anything yet with my almost two years to stay here in Thailand. I used to tell it to my close friends here that I think I haven't achieved anything, I haven't proven anything. I feel so underachieved. But what I failed to appreciate is that the every hardships that I've been here for the almost two two years of my stay here are are the achievements that no other aside from me can achieve. And from those achievements I've learned Important lessons in life. Important lessons in life. And I hope that this year, my year of transformation, I will be able to apply it. At the same time, I will be able to inspire others. As I always say way back like four years ago when I was still in college, motivation is within, guys. Inspiration is within. You have to keep inspiring yourself, motivating yourself for you not to be easily uh, demotivated or discouraged by others. Do not let others be the source of inspiration. It's just another outlet or another source, but the main one is you guys, you, yourself. So it's really important to love yourself, to feed yourself with positive vibes, positive thoughts, positive feelings, uh, all the positive ingredients, feed it to yourself, feed it to your soul. Because those positive energy that you store within you will be your food in times of darkness. Right? Like 
as Cartagena say, we will always see a silver lining. So don't forget it, okay? So, I'm going to let this dry first. So I'll get back to you guys. Wait a minute. So there we go. I'm back. I threw that painful <laughs> pill of mask. Put it over my face. So there you go. A little, little, little blockheads. Come in the next shot, blockheads, guys. So, anyway, so moving forward for 2020, I want it to be, I want this vlog to be a message for myself. And of course, to all of you that's going to watch this vlog. I want you. Self, like to yourself, like to yourself. I want you to know that you are worthy. You are amazing because you were able to pull it through the past years. It's okay if you feel, if you feel, if you feel underachieved. You feel like you're missing out something in life. It's okay that you feel lost at the moment. It's okay you feel miserable, alone, and all sorts of feeling. Because that only means that you are living, that you're still alive, you're breathing, and you're waking up every day, and that is enough reason for you to be grateful. So, for 2020, given how hard it may be, let's, or you should deal with it with grace, post composure, confidence that you can. So, for 2020, just be you, be, un be fearless to be you. As so what I, as what I said in my bio and Instagram, envision, exercise, exaggerate. Is it right? There are three E's, but I forgot. Envision, exercise. What is it? The exercise. Something about that one. So we can do it. I can do it. You can do it. So let's be positive. And I think I'm gonna end this vlog with that with that note. Like life is too short, guys. Think of why you've started. Why you've started doing things. Why you started this journey. For whom it is. For what it is. Why? And if you're able to answer those questions, telling you, you're going back in track with your life. So, I think this won't be my last monologue with myself as a vlog. I think uh, here, now and then, I'll do this one because I think it's very healthy for me. I, I can... Can document myself and I can use it in the f in the future I'm going to go back oh my god I that told myself those words so there you have it guys this is my first vlog for 2020 so it's nothing spectacular but I hope you learn one or a thing or two in this vlog if not it's okay so maybe just like look or be just excited for my next vlog <laughs> maybe that's it so thank you so much peppies i'm gonna finish uh, massaging my face so see you on my next vlog love you all we're so <laughs>